Security in this center resembles that of a prison. Gates and windows are locked, barbed wire is fixed atop the high walls, people here are not allowed to have mobile devices. But there are no criminals here. This is a treatment center for internet addicts. 判断网瘾有两个，就是说两个结果标准，通过上网影响了没影响他的学业。第二点呢，就是他能不能还还能有良好的人际交往能力。Former Chinese Army Colonel Tao Ran has been running this facility located south of Beijing for nearly 20 years. 我们大概收治了一万多个孩子，啊，那么他们的平均年龄呢，大概都在十七岁左右。about a hundred addicts, mostly teenagers, are currently being treated at the center. They must adhere to rules and take part in military-style drills as part of their rehabilitation. Most of the teens were brought here against their will. Chiu Chuo did not want us to show her or her son's faces but she shared her experience of seeing online addiction take over his life. Xiang 我在网络上可能可能模拟我想要的一个状况，然后每天在网网络里聊天、打电话，两三天左右就是这个电话都不挂，睡觉的时候也不摘这个耳机。In 2018, the World Health Organization added gaming disorder to its international classification of diseases. A decade earlier, China had classified it as a public health threat. The Internet Addiction Center is the last hope for many addicted teens and their parents, who pay a whopping 10,000 yuan, more than 1,400 US dollars, for each month of treatment here. Over the years, there have been news reports of abuse at these types of detox centers, including the use of controversial electroshock therapy and other abuses. That prompted the Chinese government to draft legislation to regulate the centers. Tao says electroshock therapy and corporal punishment are not used at his facility. Instead, it offers a range of treatments, physical, emotional, and sometimes medical. The center director does admit that patients who resist will have privileges revoked. In some extreme cases, patients have been tied to bed frames to prevent them from escaping. One former patient also reported that some people were put in solitary confinement for days at a time. Tao claims that over the years, his addiction facility has achieved a success rate of 80%. Chiu Chuo says she's seen changes in her son. China's gaming industry has exploded in the past few decades. 
The market value reached 200 billion yuan or 29 billion US dollars in 2018. With the rise comes a growing number of young online addicts. Tao estimates that one out of 10 Chinese teens is obsessed with the internet. Last year, China's education ministry directed the country's gaming regulator to limit the number of new games and limit the amount of time minors spend playing them. Tao says both game developers and the government must do more to curb internet and gaming addiction. Yeah,